there's rarely ever a moment in our life where everything lines up and everything looks perfect for us to move forward in the things that God is telling us to move forward in. Ecclesiastes 11 and 4 it says it this way, he who observes the wind will not sow and he who regards the clouds will not reap. Basically what that scripture is telling us, if we're waiting for the right circumstances, we're waiting for the stars to align, we're <laughs> waiting for, you know, whatever, um, everything to be perfect in our life for us to be obedient to the things that we know that we need to be obedient to, whether that's coming to God, whether that's starting the new project, whether that's uh, cleaning the room, wh whatever those things are that we're delaying on, that we know that we need to be doing. If we're waiting for the right moment, that right moment may never come. And so it's time, uh, it's time to move forward. It's time to just take what the Bible is telling us to do. It's given us practical wisdom. One thing that I see here in Ecclesiastes 10 and 10, another Ecclesiastes scripture, um, it lets us know at the latter part of this verse in verse 10, it says, um, but wisdom brings success. And while I was meditating on this and I was taking my notes for like, what is God trying to say to me? I think it's interesting that um, in this particular verse is the 10th verse. We know that 10 is a number for uh, order um, God bringing things into um, alignment and structure. And so where things are out of order in your life, wisdom is what's going to bring the success. It's not the perfect moment or the perfect timing. It's you having the strategy. It's you having the godly wisdom and the sense enough to be obedient to that thing that you need to be doing. And so I'm living proof of it. It's 11 p.m. tonight. Um, they say this is the worst time to post a YouTube video. I'm posting it now because I made a commitment to myself that I'm going to post multiple times here per day to just give you guys everything that God is giving me. And so I want to leave this world empty. God is calling you to do the same. And so don't wait for that perfect moment. That perfect moment may never come. So God bless you guys. Love you guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.